I've been broke. I ain't never been poor. I knew I was going to be rich. I knew I was going to be rich. I want to be rich since I was a little boy. I was a little kid on the bike selling candy. That was me. Hey, man, my name Brian Bean. Can you get somebody? <laughs> hey, man, uh, my name is Brian Bean, and I am, I am six years old, and I just want to know if you would buy one of these candy bars. <laughs> made up my own scripts and everything. Wait, I think I'm so good at these scripts. I've been scripting for 20, for, for 40, 40 years. Hey man, I know last week you didn't want chocolate. So this week I bring to you a bag of now and later. <laughs> hey man, you told me last week that you had an aversion to chocolate. I now have now and laters and Jolly Ranchers. No, then I come back, then I come back next week. You said that you to get back with you next week. So I am simply following up. <laughs> Would you like a Reese's cup? <laughs> All right, let me stop. Let me stop. We got a 10 o'clock. Y'all quit fooling with me. Stop playing now. Y'all play too much. That's the problem as it is. We play too much in this organization. Jimmy Slayton, they say we silly. They say they say you can't make money and be silly at the same time. Man, y'all better loosen up. Then I come back on my bike. Man, last time I talked to you, you said it was hot. I am now selling ice cream cones. <laughs> ice cream cones. <laughs> I put some Kool-Aid in that cup, and I <laughs> add some sugar. And them little, y'all remember them little styrofoam cups? Don't act like it's just me. Y'all know them styrofoam cups? We had to peel the styrofoam off around the sides and lick the top. <laughs> 50 cent. 50 cent. Sugar, some doggone water, and a styrofoam cup. 50 cent. 50 cent. And ma'am, this week we have a special. If you get a, a pack of nine ladies, you get a free. It, isn't it hot out here, ma'am? That's why I learned to ask questions. Ma'am, are you hot? Shoot, let's go. All right, y'all play too much. <laughs> Where was I, man? Okay, two things. Law of large numbers. The law of large numbers demands that if you do something long enough, a ratio will eventually show up. That's what it means. If you do something long enough, a ratio will show up. Now, what does that mean? New people, initially, you still haven't really learned like the verbiage of the business. You haven't learned like right, quite what to say yet. And it's okay, you, you guys been in two, three days and we've been moving like crazy. You don't even know how to handle the pyramid question. You don't know why people don't see it. You don't know why a person wouldn't want to adjust the W-4 and get their money up front instead of getting a tax refund. You don't know why a person would want to stay in debt when they've been trying to do it by themselves for a long time. You don't know why a person would want single digit returns instead of double digit returns. You don't even know what income shifting really means. You don't know the five streams of income. You don't know the four personality types. You don't know the five fundamentals. You don't know the 10 reasons people quit. You don't know the eight components of a perfect storm. You don't know all these things. You're not supposed to. But if you do something long enough, a ratio will appear. You might get no, 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 yes. No, 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 yes. You're one for eight. You now have your ratio. Put that in your notes. I need my ratio to show. I just need my ratio to show you one for eight. Congratulations. No, 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 yes. Now the ratio is getting better. Part two of the law of large numbers is a ratio wants to continue. People are watching and waiting for you to quit or succeed. It's one or the other. They're watching and waiting. And you got to decide what show you're going to give them. You're going to give them the quitting show? That's easy. Or you're going to let them see you succeed. Right? There, there are three stages of acceptance. You know what? I can't get into that tonight. But listen, I'm going to put it this way. Give them a good show. 